Welcome back to Envy Fishing. So today is a day to be remembered because we are making a round trip to California. And then we're gonna hit up Pyramid Lake along the way. And yeah. tomorrow we're gonna be fishing for Lahant and Cutthroat Trout, which is quite a rare species of trout. You have to have a special permit to be able to target these fish. And it's just gonna be a special experience overall. So it's gonna be amazing. So stay tuned and we'll catch you when we're in Idaho. Welcome back. Well, we are finally here at Pyramid Lake. Look how gorgeous this looks. It is pristine water. So basically, Josh is gonna kind of explain what we're gonna be doing here for the next couple days. So we got three days on Pyramid Lake because we decided in Idaho, um, we didn't get any filming done because the wind, obviously. Um, this is Falls, I don't know if you said that, but we decided to stay three days here. So we're about to get to some fishing and tomorrow we might try some fly fishing, but we might catch some giant trout, so stay tuned. Nah, they don't look like perch. They got more trout features. Oh, there's a 20 incher, or a fucking 20 pounder right there. <laughs> oh, baby one? Oh, it went down again. Oh yeah, dude, the baby's are kind of moving. Dude, you're literally getting baby shoes. I'm hoping a big one comes over and like tries to steal it. I can, dude. You're on. I'm on? No, I'm not. Dude, it was swimming. It was swimming with it like in your foot. Dude, they're attacking the bobber. I gotta go down there. Oh, there's a fucking huge one under me. Dude, no, I don't want to have to fucking retie right now, dude. I'm on. You're on, you're on. Oh. Let him take it, let him take it. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I'll bring him up to you. Hey, you're good, you're good, you're good. You can take a line. He's probably gonna have so much energy. Yeah, I know. That's a, that's a, that might be the reason. You do have the heavy chest. I do. You want to back up? Yeah, yeah. Oh, I'm, I'm at a rock edge. You're good. You're good. You're good. You're good. What? Oh, you go, dude. Josh, off the snag, he just bit it. Two. Okay, we got to bring him back. 25. 25. 25. 25. Okay, uh, I'm going to let him I'm gonna get him off the hook. Or you, you can do it, you do it. Here, I'm gonna fuck, fix my camera. Give me a second. Hey guys, oh. we got our first Lahontan. Giant. Guys, that was, here, point towards me really quickly. That was off a snag. I popped this snag out and he instantly grabbed it. All right, we gotta hurry this up. Yeah, I know, I know. I'm gonna reel in your rod real quick. Do it, do it, do it. You're good. 
didn't even put my hand around that thing. He's off, he's off. Huh? He, he's off. Huh? Yeah, I got it out. Right. Kind of just came out on its own, to be honest. All right, you get down here. You're losing about an inch from the tail. That's a 25. 25 all day, guys. Look at the cutthroat market. I know, dude. Ready? Yep. Alrighty guys, you are about to enter the city of Lahontan Cutthroat Trout. Alright guys, wasn't recording, but I am on, and it's just peeling. Dude, it's down to my white line. What? It's down to my white line. You need to try to hold it more, bro. No, try to hold your line more. Remember, you have 12 actually. You need to be able to hold that fish. This is a giant. Yeah. I'm not kidding. Did you go pro quarter? Yeah. I, I wasn't recording at the time, but... You know how much battery life it's on? 31. Okay, so we're good. Okay. Seems like he's tiring out a little bit. Try to get some line back up. What you need to do? Don't fully power him in, you know? Yeah, yeah. You need to get some line back up in case he has another run. This is insane. This is about the same size as mine. Okay, bet, bet, bet. Try to, if you can, back up just a bit. Okay. So you have more lean wind. Lean, lean. Oh, what the fuck? Okay, okay. Yeah, bring him in, bring him in. Can you like... Yeah. Come on this way. Yes, dude. Yes. Oh my god. It's not like crazy big, but... Dude, that thing fought. Yeah, that thing fought harder than mine, bro. Holy crap. Thank god. Thing. I thought you weren't gonna get one, bro. <laughs> oh, he's fin hooked? He's fin hooked. Actually? Yeah. That's why he fought so hard. That makes sense. Okay. Ooh. Oh, you just died. Jeez. Hell yeah. I know, dude. It's so pretty. 22 and a half? You can technically say that's 23. 22 and a half. 22 and a half. Josh just got his first La Hunt. 22 and a half entry. Cool. She's ready. Look at the. That is such a pretty fish. I'll let her go when she's ready. It was a long fight, guys. Yeah, she was pulling hard. Oh, she wants to say what's up. Hooked up. 
Oh, dude, I don't want you. This feels like dead weight. That's what it feels like, dude. Right. This might be big. Yeah. Oh, yeah, that's it. I don't want him to cross my line. I think I got time to use one up. This might be a big one, dude. Oh, he wants to go for another run. Oh, let him. Oh, let him. This is the, this could be the thirty. Second fish on the fly rod. You're right about the four on. I'm telling you, bro. It actually drains you. Dude, you just feel like dead weight, though. Mm-hmm. What was that, Jackson? What was that? Hey. Rod tip up, bro. Rod tip up. All right, yeah, 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 yeah. Get him in, get him in. This could be the 30, dude. Right here. <laughs> Second fish on the fly rod. My first one was a 26-inch, like, 5-pound cutty. Nice. Yeah, I cut like this. Fucking my first big fish. Jeez. He's smart, dude. Got him. Got him. There you go, dude. Holy shit, dude. That is the biggest thing. Dude, my hand. <laughs> it hurts so bad. I don't even know what's practicing. Dude, it popped out. Actually? Popped out as I netted it. Dude, that means that I was the only thing keeping that thing in there was pressure. Yeah. That is insane, dude. Dude, can you just take him with my phone? That's a good like eight, eight pound trout right there. I'm gonna guess this is a 10 to 8. Oh, dang. It's just for this kid's too. Really? Is. Lahant and cutthroat. Dude. He's biting the net. Oh. Let me step back. Guy. And then there's like a like a 30 behind him. Alright guys, I'm on. Oh, he's got some fight left. Oh, yeah. You can power this dude in if you really want. He's like an 18, maybe 20. Jeez, he's a pretty one though. Oh my god. <laughs> There he goes. This guy hit the black small midge. Yeah. I have one more if you want it. Sweet. Dude, that thing is gorgeous. Holy. Gonna get a release on this guy. There he goes. 
All right, I'm on again, guys. Literally seconds after it hit the water, dude. It's the color for sure. Huh? It's the color for sure. Doesn't it doesn't matter too much about the size, I'm pretty sure. Uh, it doesn't feel crazy big because it hasn't been pulling drag, but it's just the start of the fight, so. Oh, <laughs> really under your net. All right, sweet. Yeah, about the same size. Huge head, though. Oh, yeah, dude. What he the red. The red. Oh, did he? Oh, shit. All right, guys, this is like our last two hours of fishing this lake. And I just caught a 25-inch Lahontan. Absolutely giant. We're gonna get a release on it. Oh, he's ready to go. Oh yeah. He's off. Just like that, that's the end of our Pyramid Lake trip. It was overall an amazing experience and we got on some giant fish. Jackson caught a 28 inch Lahontan cutthroat trout, which is a once in a lifetime fish for us. I caught a 25 and I'm super grateful for it. And it's my new PB trout. But anyways, our next stop's gonna be California where we're gonna be fishing for some leopard sharks, stingrays, and largemouth bass, and really anything that catches our eye. So stay tuned and we'll see you in California.